My name is Paul Murray. Uh, my wife, Karen Murray, I met at church back in uh, 1983. We met at Progressive and we were married in 1985. And we were married 21 years before we had kids. And uh, we, we couldn't have kids and God finally put it on our heart to try and adopt. And it was uh, one Sunday morning, I woke up out of a dream and the Lord told me, he said, it's not about you. And so we went on, got on a list and went through all the classes. And at the end of uh, 2005, we were ready and got a foster care license. And in 2006 is when we met Jayla. June 28, 2006, it was my birthday. I was working graveyard at the time, came home from work and hopped into bed, woke up about 2.30 that afternoon, trying to you know, figure out, okay, where are we gonna go for birthday dinner, celebrate my birthday. And about three o'clock that afternoon, we got a call from San Francisco and they called us and said, you can pick up your son today. So we went from thinking birthday to, you know, putting some gas in the car, heading to San Francisco to go pick up our son. That uh, was special to me because it was my birthday. It was like my birthday gift. And at the time, my mother was still alive, so she got to meet him, got to hold him. And it was a few months after that that she went home to be with the Lord. Uh, it took seven months to finalize that adoption. In February 07, we were in San Francisco in court to finalize that adoption. And me and Karen were standing there, and I was holding Jalen in front of the judge, and the judge began to tell us and explain to us what it meant to finalize, and she decreed that he would be an heir to us in every way. So that day, uh, February 7, 2007, Jalen became Jalen Paul Murray. About four years later, the Lord put it on our heart to do it again, and we didn't have any expectations. It could have been a boy, it could be a girl, just whatever your will is for us. Well, we finally, the adoption agency came to us with two brothers, Leandre and Janelle. Andre was four, he just turned four. Janelle was about two and a half. We met him one Wednesday afternoon at the county office. While we were there, we had to interact with them for two hours in front of two social workers while they evaluated us. And the pressure was on. End of that session, we went, they needed to go to the bathroom, I being the man. You know, we were at the end, we were washing our hands in the sink. And I looked in the mirror, and I picked Janelle up and put him in my arms, and looked in the mirror and said to myself, wow, he looks like he could be your son. Two weeks later, we took placement of Andre and Janelle and began to become a family. Well, they told us it was gonna take a long time to final. It ended up taking 19 months, two social workers in our home two to three times a month for 19 months. It was long, it was, it was tough. So finally, November 12, November 2012, we transitioned from foster care placement to adoptive placement. And they let us know we're just waiting on a court date. A few days later, they called Karen and gave her the date. She called me and the date was November 20th. November 20th happens to be Karen's birthday. So we started the journey when we took placement of Jalen on my birthday, and we finalized it on Karen's birthday. It was like the Lord was putting his stamp of approval on it. In 365 days in a year, the two days that we share birthdays are the days that our kids share a special bond with us on our birthday. Andre officially became Leandre Stephen Murray and Janelle, Janelle Avant Murray, and we officially became a family. For me, I love fatherhood, I enjoy it. Um, I look back and wonder, wow, you know, I mean, I'm glad I did this. And I don't know, I can't imagine myself not being a dad right now. And as the pastor says, hey, I'm enjoying the trip. So my wish is, you know, fathers keep doing what you're doing. Happy Father's Day to all, especially my dad, Deacon Murray, happy Father's Day, and God bless.